from it. All right, the coronavirus, obviously, on the mind of almost everybody in the country. And for some coping with it, it can bring a lot of anxiety and a lot of emotions, mm -hmm. too. Mm -hmm. We have Christina Hobbs and Alan Air too, with some tips to help all of us cope during these high stress times. Yeah, it's extremely tough because there's so much going on, there's so much fear, there's so much anxiety. So a couple of things to think about. Decide how you're going to manage your stress. Um, it's really important that you look at relaxation, maybe it's music, art, meditation, prayer, hobbies. You need to keep yourself grounded. Develop a sound philosophy. And when I say that, there are some certain things that I'm just going to do this. I'm going to take care my family. I'm going to stick to my routine. And it might not be that you're going to the gym, but you can go out, you can jog, you can do things that you're used to doing. Um, look for the positive in every situation, in every circumstance. So, you know, the kids are home. We get to spend more time together. Um, we have time to relax together. Look for the positive in this situation. So look at the, what is priority in your life and really making those priorities, exactly, right? Exactly, exactly. All right, so sometimes we can't control everything, though. You can only control what you can control. And there are some things that you need to just accept it and let it go, let the stress yeah. go, because you can't change these things. So, you know, there are some things that you need to focus on, which are just your responsibilities. Mm -hmm. That's what you need to focus on, which is your family and your health. So then you've got facts, fundamentals, and faith. And right. This is really important. What about the facts? So sometimes, <laughs> you know, social media sensationalizes things. You need to make sure you're getting the right information. And then there's the fundamentals. Focus on your basic necessities. So maintain uh, sanitary precautions. Understand mm. that social distancing might be tough, but it's necessary. And then your faith, knowing that, you know what, we're going to be okay. Things like this happen, but we're resilient. We make it through it. And just focus on being positive about the situation, the be the most that you can be, because this is tough. This is tough on everybody. I mean, we're talking about the the stress for two weeks, maybe a month. And I think back uh, to, I mean, before our time, back mm -hmm. when, um, you know, our parents or the, our grandparents' generation in the 40s during World War II. Mm -hmm. The, the stuff they had to put up with? Right. Yeah, we're not even close to that. We're okay. We're yeah. going to be okay. So I think we need to focus on, you know, stay calm, do what you need to do as far as precautions, and really just be okay yeah, with you, it. You, you may not have many patients coming in the office, but you can still do, communicate I with people. I can do telehealth. So if you're interested, I have several therapists at the office, 501-825-0189. Um, mental health is kind of what we focus on as well, not just relationships. So if you need counseling, please call us. All right. Christina, thank you so much.